All right, we're jumping right into this one because I have never done this before and I don't know how long it's going to take. Well, welcome back to our Road to Orion series here on our second account. And in our last year, our top comment was from Steve asking us to get the Hurricane Gold, but we have to do it in Plunder. So that's what we'll be doing today. And if you want to leave a weapon and challenge suggestion, go ahead and leave it down in the comments below. I'll have a comment down there as well with all the weapons that we've already completed. So make sure you check that out first. That way we don't get any repeats. And I have my Hurricane class right here. I already went ahead and put it together. And it turns out I already have this thing leveled up. I must have got this leveled up on a double XP weekend, which is unfortunate because I really wanted to kind of show off how fast you can get levels in Plunder. Because the other day when Plunder came out, we were leveling up some weapons. And I think we got our Victus XMR fully leveled up in just one game of Plunder. So I don't think levels would have been an issue here. You just got to kind of do contracts. But I think kills might be an issue. So we're going to be figuring out just how hard it is to get gold in Plunder. But I have a feeling it's going to be a little bit easier than I think. Because you get unlimited respawns in Plunder. I just need to find like a hot spot to land at. We need to go somewhere where there's going to be a lot of people. And as for our camo challenges, we need to get like 50 kills with it, which is standard for each weapon. And then we need to get 50 kills while ADS. We need to get 50 kills with a silencer. And then I think like 30 kills while prone. Uh, prone is probably going to be the most difficult challenge we have today. But if we do manage to get that all done, then we need to just get three kills without dying. But I do not play a whole lot of Warzone or Plunder for that matter. So uh, this is all kind of new to me. Look at this dude up here sniping. Get down here and fight me like a man. Oh, there we go. That's our first down. Hopefully that Semtex can get him. And we got somebody else on the hill here. Can I please climb this? Okay, they're both up here. Let me toss a stun their way. And I'm dead. Okay, here's the guys that took me out before. And they took me out again. So far, it's a struggle to even get a kill. And that's probably because I haven't played a whole lot of this plunder. But I remember back in like the first war zone where everybody would just land in like, what was it shipping container, storage yard, something like that. And that was like the, the PVP area of plunder. And now I just keep getting messed up on the observatory. So I'm going to try to find somewhere else to go. And I have absolutely no money. Zero. I'm placed 33rd, which I assume is like the worst. Let me try to find some money or something and maybe i can grab a uav and see where people are at i actually have a bomb drone i'm gonna go ahead and use this and scout out the area i see literally nobody not a single soul in this area how much is a uav in this there's only supply uavs so i can't even buy just a normal uav this is dumb how am i supposed to find people i'm starting to think if all of our games kind of end up like this our best bet for getting any kind of camo progress is going to be during pre-game does that even count for camo progress i think it might it used to back in the old war zone i know you can definitely get like weapon levels doing it but do it count for progression okay well somebody over here has got a big bag of money i'm gonna go see if i can take them out Oh my Lanta, I can't hit a shot to save my life. This is like the antithesis of shipment. Even if I'm playing bad, I'm still going to probably get 30, 40 kills. And this, I've been playing for how long and I have none. Well, let's hope this changes around right here. Let's go. That's one. And I'm immediately dead because I had a prox mine down. Whatever I said about this being easier than I thought, maybe not. There we go. No, he's got teammates. I am playing the solo too. This is plunder quads. Maybe I should be doing squad fill. And that also adds another layer of difficulty to this. Cause even if I down them, I'm not guaranteed to get the kill. And these games last a bit too. These are like half hour games. All I'm doing is getting clapped. So you know what? I'm going to leave this one and maybe we try a different approach. And like I was saying, here's our camo progress. It has not changed very much since that last game, but uh, we only have two kills with the suppressor, 42 kills while ADS zero wall prone we're gonna be doing this for a bit okay now time to see if camo progress tracks while in pregame so we have some nice people here that aren't even playing and we'll see if that counts as the ads and the suppressed kill actually we got a few let's get some prone kills while we're at it because if so, this could be the easiest mode to get gold in. It could actually simultaneously be the easiest and the most difficult mode to get camos. Because in pregame, all these people are doing are like loading up their bongs, you know, hitting the elf bar, maybe having a, a chip or two. So you can just take out a bunch of people that aren't even playing and get progress for it. And then when the game starts, that's where it switches up. And I'm the dude with the elf bar loading the bong, getting fucked up, but I'm actually playing. And now we have a squad. So I will go wherever these guys go, as long as there's people. Oh, they're immediately dropping. At least one of them did. You know what? I'm with it. I'll just try to follow somebody else though to their drop and take them out. I'll go to this little city over here. See, I, I went ahead and went with a squad and then I'd even go with the guy that dropped early. Oh, got one. Ooh, that's another one, hopefully. Ooh, ooh, I'm surrounded. Give me time to reload, please. 
Thank you. Appreciate it. Sorry, Shredder. You gotta sit down. And I see your buddy on the roof. He's not gonna get me. Ooh. Bro. Eat an aid. Eat a stun, too. I'm taking this fight to you, buddy. You wanted the smoke. Oh, he must have jumped away. Coward. Was that an actual dude? That might have been a bot. Oh, I hear you running around in here. Got your bitch ass. You know what? Assassination. Actually, probably shouldn't have done that. I don't think that counts for uh, our camos. But that was just for me. I was trying to find the dude with the money bag near us. Bet I don't have any ammo. Ooh, don't matter if I got ammo or not. They'll bring it to me. Fucking Uber Eats. Oh! Lele. Oh, wait, let's get a prone kill. Got him. But the dude with the money bag is still nearby. He's got to be inside the stronghold. I'll give up my high ground just to go take a peek. Somebody just broke out a window. Oh, here we go. There he is. Came right to me. I didn't have to do anything. I don't think that was it, though. There's still more. Was it the UAV? Oh, there's a few people here. Oh, no. We had a hot start, though. How many kills did we get? Eight? Dastardly. Oh, but this is the bad part about playing squads. Is I have to wait to respawn. And is it even going to respawn me where I died? Or where or am I going to respawn near where my team is at? Maybe I should just keep playing solo. Yeah, I died all the way over there. Damn, dude. Okay, well, at least we tried squads. That way we know how it goes. But in the future, I'm probably just going to stick to solos. And now we reconnect with our other teammates. We'll see what these guys are up to. Oh, but well, we have an advanced UAV? Fuck yeah, dude. That works. Go ahead and jump down. Yeah, jump right to me. We got him. Let's go. And we'll get the prone kill while we're at it. Oh, there we go. 50 kills while ADS is now done. Oh, and his buddy wanted to come and join the fight. Oh, it was G Money too? Oh, you're lucky I'm not on the J Money account. And all my teammates want to do is just climb to the top of buildings. I'm not about that. I want to go do something. Not just snipe at people. But if they're going to keep marking enemies, I'll go do the dirty work. Now, nah, I just ran probably about a fucking 5k. So if I don't get these kills, I'm going to be a little upset. I'm going to be fucking furious, actually. I don't know how I fumbled that so bad. There's like a whole fledged war going on here. This is actually kind of sweet. Oh, I landed right next to somebody to even know. Okay, I'll take it. And there's an attack helicopter over here. This is just like fucking war. There's too many shots going off to know what's going on. All I know is I'm getting kills throughout it all. Oh, I'm nasty. I'm gross. I'm gross. I'm gross. I just have to keep running. Until I can get somewhere where I can reload. Holy shit. Oh, barely made it in. Oh, I'm still going. Anyone else want to challenge me? Oh, yep, 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 they do. Oh, yeah. Oh, I got fucking leveled by a car. I just got tossed into the side of the mountain. That was ridiculous. I had a nice little run there, though. But that is game. And I'm going to go ahead and leave this game. I'm pretty sure we had, yep, 15 kills, which is pretty good for plunder. But that would be an awful game on shipment. All right, squad fills off. No disrespect to my, my former teammates. I ain't just, I'm just not doing that. So it looks like some of the prone kills counted. And we're getting up there with our kills on suppressor. All right, so here's my strat going into this game. I'm going to watch the number of players still in the plane and when i say the biggest drop off is when i'm jumping so there's 115 people on the plane okay now everybody's dropping we just hit to 78 so around this area is where all the heat's gonna happen let's go let's get the prone kill yeah there we go quick team wipe it's hard to even go for these prone kills like mid plunder game i feel like if i lay down that I, I lose my line of sight on them i have to be like 10 steps ahead Oh, and that's a prone kill. Finally, one wall actually in game. He just brought me all of his money too. Dumbass. What's going on, dude? Oh, you're awesome. Thank you for the prone kill. And after three games, we still only have one camo done. We are making a little bit of progress on our prone kills, but this goes so slow. The way I see it, I don't think this warm up is uh, cheap for the challenge. I feel like this is a little reward I get for playing the whole 25 minutes of each game, making sure that I at least get some camo progress here and there. So I only get like 30 seconds to hop in here and try to get some kills. And I have literally only been getting like one kill each time. So every time I go to lay down and shoot somebody, they're already out of my fucking vision. 
And then within the last 10 seconds, you can't even do any damage. So I would say it's extremely balanced. I'm going to follow you to the ends of the earth and fuck you up, pal. Never mind, never mind, never mind. I take it all back. No, I don't. So I'm not really too sure what part of the kill counts for the camo. Like if it's me knocking them, that counts as my prone kill. Or if it's me killing them while they're knocked, that counts. The world may never know. And I got stuck on a fucking staircase. I couldn't back up. I love people that just have like no ears. The people that play just listening to music helps me out quite a bit. And that's like five games of plunder now. And uh, we are getting nowhere fast. Only nine kills. No point in backing out and checking the camel progress. I know there's none. No way, dude. Oh, I even lined up for the prone kill. All you did was turn and shoot. That's fucked up. Ooh. That's two quick prones. Oh, you want more? Okay, yep, they did. No shot, dude. I'm so ass, you deserve to kill me. Thank God, dude. I cannot control this thing at range to save my life. I just need to make sure that I get the prone kill, though. Thank you. Oh, and there's our suppressed kills, finally. On probably the worst kill of my life. But a camo is a camo. Oh, that's a quick 2e. Oh, even perhaps a 3? Yes, sir. No fucking way. That's right at the... Excuse me, what? How come he gets to kill me when the game ends, but I can't kill him? He was already down. He immediately just got back up and was free to shoot. Whatever, dude. And I've been playing for about two hours at this point, and I still need three more prone kills before we can even start working on gold. This sucks. I have no idea how I'm going to do three kills without dying. It already seems like I've been playing for millennia, trying to just go for, like, silenced kills and kills while prone. Kills without dying seems impossible. Come on, is this it for prone kills? It should be. Oof. Come on, that's a rank up? There we go. Neon loud, baby. All prone kills are done. I think I might be on a streak right now. Never mind. Take it all back. Immediately got picked off. Oh, hold on. It just said I'm on a five kill streak, but it said that for like any kill milestone I get. And I've definitely died in between like almost all of my kills. So there's no way I'm on an actual streak. Except for that two that I'm on right now. Get stunned, bitch. Oh, that should be a three right there. Holy shit. Come on, that's two. And that's three right there. Let's go. Oh, shit. Let's go. Double down. Good thing that guy went for the revive there. I wouldn't have been able to kill him otherwise. Ooh, 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 ooh. Come on. I just need one more here to get some progress. Oh, there we go, baby. Perfect. Oof. I got 20 kills this game so far. And a few streaks to boot. Best case scenario here is that all kills count as streaks and plunder since we do get the little pop-ups on the screen. And that would actually uh, kind of make plunder busted for going for like kills without dying. So I guess we'll check after this game. Oh, there we go. That's three, baby. Perfect. So actually, the three kills without dying... Not as bad as I thought it would be. That actually might be the fastest we've gotten progress so far today. But let's see. Oh yeah, 4 out of 10. Seen 6 more of those. Alright, now let's try to get 3 kills of the dying in the warm-up. This is probably going to be our first time doing it if we actually accomplish it. Okay, that's 1. My asshole almost fell out jumping down that. And you know what? If we just get 1 and the warm-up ends, that's fine. Hopefully it carries over. It don't. And it won't. Oh, that's a quick two. We take those. Come on, one more. No, I got surrounded. I got shish kebobbed. Damn, that was a good start, too. 
Wow, they're actually just camping in here. Is this how they play? Is this how people play plunder? Just camping? That's fucked up. Especially in a stronghold because there's like one entrance. I'm still going to go back and try to mess with them. Ooh. Ooh. Fuck both of y'all. And your self-revive. Now uh, y'all come back now, you hear? I'll do the shit that they're doing. Go ahead and come on back. So now they're like, dude, look, I got this great idea for plunder. We're gonna go in the stronghold and people just run right to us. We'll go ahead and try it, you mark-ass bitch. I don't have the patience for this. Oh, come on. That was so close. Oh, I stuck him. Lick my balls. That's three right there. Oh, wait, that's gold. Let's go. Okay, so I think it, it literally just popped up and said bloodthirsty. I think any kills during plunder are, are all streaks. So this is awful for every other camo, but for getting gold, it's actually kind of nice. And once I take this guy out, I'll be quitting to go look at my camo. Oh, poor baby. Did you fall down? Did you die? Let's interrogate you. Where's your team at? Eh, I'll assassinate you. Why not? Bitch. I might as well take out some more people while I'm hot. While I'm going crazy. I'll go till I die. At this point, I'm committed. All right, pal. You get assassinated too. Whew. Why am I all of a sudden a monster? It's like the second I get gold, I just let loose. Okay, never mind. I'm dead. All right. Let's go check out gold on this thing and make sure that we actually have it. Look at that. Beautiful. Actually got gold only playing plunder. Now let's go ahead and see what it looks like in game. All right, this is what the hurricane looks like in game. And unfortunately in game here, uh, it looks like they kind of reverted the last changes they did for our hardcore private match. Cause there's more HUD than ever here. Like they got rid of the tokens, but I have all the, the HUD in the bottom right now. They just can't get private matches right, dude. But anyways, it looks pretty nice. Pain in the ass to get, but it looks cool. But there you have it. Probably one of our most painstaking challenges yet. Not that it was difficult. Well, it was difficult, but it did take so much time to do. Right now, my recording's at two hours and 50 minutes is what it took. And we already had this thing leveled up and some of the like camel progress knocked out. So I can't imagine doing it from scratch, but uh, I'm going to go ahead and end the video here. Uh, if you guys want to leave a suggestion down below, go ahead and leave it. Uh, I'll have a comment down there with all the weapons that we've already done. So make sure you check that out before leaving your weapon and your challenge suggestion. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Later.